Let me begin my speech by giving you a question. What are you good at in your opinion? Computer coding, modeling, graphic designing, or you don't know? If you have got the answer, means that you are in the level of escalating the quality of your talent. However, maybe you still have something that you don't know yet because you never tried it. Then, for those who don't know yet, you are really good at but start from the scratch. Ladies and gentlemen, this is story of Pambu, a young boy from Yogyakarta. In high school, he was invited to attend art puppet exhibition, but he said no. It's not like something that attracts him. But his father asked him to join a mana puppet making workshop, and he said yes. So he learns and tries the best to create a puppet show. The days come. And can you guess what happened, ladies and gentlemen? Yes. We only view his puppet show in the art of the gallery. And many people said that his puppet was so ugly and unfinished. Finally, he gave up. He wants to quit, thinking that he is not really good at it. But five years later, I saw him again in the future in half page in a national press and he become a famous puppet maker and performs in Yogyakarta. What does story tell you ladies and gentlemen? Yes, when we love something and the claim that is so of talent but this is your process for you find it, then the process will be determined yes or no. So. Have you failed in doing something? It's the same with me. And when I fail, I feel like I don't have talent. Because we have failed before. We don't confident in doing something again. Like a pamburek. But I thought you just know. Now, let's see our mindset on failure. If some people say that failure is the result of our effort, but I would say that. Failure is the beginning of success, like Mariana has said. Why? Why so? Failure led to discovery, our talent to experience, and people exposure. Ladies and gentlemen, failure exposed us to extensive experience. In the past, when I was senior high school, I participated in theater contests where I was very happy because my teacher believed in me. But finally, I failed. I think that I confident I could get the trophy, but I failed with the, all the dream I want. And finally, I returned home. I took again. I should be said that this competition was a lot of such as I gain you knowledge, I gain you feedback, and I get stage exposure from there. And I think that I have talent that is still hidden and unfold. Like many people, they have same skill, but they can excel further and earlier than me. But ladies and gentlemen, three years later, my theater skills are verified and recognized by winning a provincial award from Art Council because I practice that until the dreams opportunity come. Ladies and gentlemen, <clears throat> value also exposes us to many people. By exposing in front of many people, it can make us to know what our mistake, our weakness, and even our strengths all know. Further, we can have best example like we practice this is the basic our standard success, like a Pambo's experience on Valier's puppet. This brought him to a famous a puppet artist and videos of the world, a puppet maker and perform. By exposing like Pambo, we will know better and refine our talent. Ladies and gentlemen, back to ourselves now. There is a fear of trying again. And I'm sure, but 
let's start from the single step like we get new friends new networks and new relationship and of course your experience to extensive that what are you really good at or to ask college what are you really good at until it is verified don't stop trying when you fail don't hide but see your feedback it is words sensors from upside of ourselves that's way the self-confidence and optimism to see yourself to grow that you can become a person who had the talent in the fields you want. I'll move as thank you.